Hi everyone and welcome to Rags to Riches. I'm Lauren and today's video is my plans for my shop, my business. Um, I have a few plans that I want to do and achieve this year. Um, I know I've already done like goals for the year but these are what my plans are. Um, to I feel like it's totally different, you know, these are just the things that are going to help my business grow and yeah, okay. So I'm just going to get into it. Not really got much to say today, <laughs> apart from subscribe. Um, and if you say hi and who you are, I can give you shout outs on videos. So yeah, I also do my videos quite far in advance. So it will be like a month or two down the line that you will get a shout out. So come say hi and subscribe. Anyway, okay, my plans for my business is so... I want to say about five months ago, I stopped doing this and I should have carried it on, but I kind of couldn't because um, I was on the sick from my job because I wanted to I wanted to go on the sick, still have job security, but also try and work in my business full time and it ended up working out. And yeah, so I said goodbye to my old job. So I couldn't post in community Facebook pages and I only do this once a month and I've been kicked out of a few community pages because they don't like business posts. Anyway, this just part of it. You just got to have tough skin and just do it. Um, so I just would post saying, hi, I'm Lauren. I've got a new business, Attic Treasures. I'd also put the link in in it so that people could click on it um basically explaining what we do what we sell um please come and support our business by click by liking it um just something along them lines so i don't do this once a month and it was always the beginning of every month so that's what i'm going to do again and it continuously grows my business and it gets a lot of people in the door so i'm going to be doing that again um i want to do three collabs this year um i have three people in mind on instagram to do collabs collabs are always best to do on instagram because it's just where it's mostly done you don't get many on facebook not a lot anyway so i really really want to do that um just just a little something um a little something special that's all uh, so yeah, I want to do three this year, um, and I've, obviously, like I say, I've got three in mind. Um, I don't know when I'm going to do them, but I'll be doing them. I'll be starting that pretty soon. <laughs> um, so because I have taken over the entire building, so the shop is basically just two rooms and a toilet, um, and then there was a, a flat upstairs, and then it's at the side of building as well two rooms downstairs in the flat um i've taken over the entire space now and i want to get them all decorated and sorted so that when it's time when because i'm going to be putting planning permission to put stairs in the shop to go upstairs into the flat so that people can look around at furniture so yeah i need to get that i need to get the room sorted for that um also, my next one is get the planning permission to do that. <laughs> um, I want to make over 2k a month. Um, if you haven't seen my goals for the year, that is also one of my goals for that. And it is very, very achievable. Um, and I'm very, very close. And as soon as I smash that, then I'll be, I'll be up in it. I'll be putting a new figure in place for that. Um, I want to learn upholstery. Um, I've got a gentleman that reupholsters some chairs and stuff for me, but I also want to learn it for myself. Um, I do know kind of how to do it because that's sort of the job. I didn't do upholstery, but I was doing sewing, so I kind of know how to do it, but I just don't want to do it. <laughs> I'm, like, scared to do it myself. Okay. I want to get um, a sewing machine and start designing cushions for the shop. Um, 
so yeah that's another thing that I want to do that my plans are I also want to get stickers for all my items so basically so if say someone in my shop bought this little teacup underneath it I want it to have a sticker on the bottom saying found at attic treasures because I think it's really I think it's really nice um, and it's like okay yeah I'm, I actually got that from that shop so that's what I want to do and then I paint furniture for customers so at the back of or underneath a table or drawers etc somewhere where it's, you can't really see it at the back or whatever um, I want it to say refurbished at Attic Treasures so yeah just because it's it's like marketing but it's in a simple way being done so say if somebody bought that teacup and if they bought it for a friend then they could be like oh that's where you got it from oh, I must go there and check it out so it's a small marketing way um, that I want to do and I think it'll be really special for the shop um, and last but not least I want to do some workshops so I want to do um, like wreath making classes uh, at Christmas time or because my mum's a florist a trained professional florist so I actually want her to do that um, I can do like the nibbles and stuff that people want to eat and I can I can get all the decorations and stuff that people want um, so yeah so workshops like that are maybe some painting classes for painted furniture um, yeah I think it would be really really fun so that is my plan for the shop <laughs> uh, there isn't much and it probably that list will probably grow as ideas flow in and out and inspiration strikes um, but like the stickers and, and the making the pillows and stuff I've had that idea for at least two months and so because it's a new year that is something that I really really want to achieve so yeah um just a small little exercise for you now guys is I really want you to think okay what are my plans what what are my goals how much do I want to earn if this is your like side hustle say eBay Etsy whatever and it's your side hustle right set a target of how much you want to earn and then think right okay I say you want to earn extra 300 pounds every month that means you know you need to say if you're doubling up on everything then okay you need to be spending 300 pound a month you need to be spending 300 pound a month to make 600 if you know what I mean and then continuously grow it and grow it and grow it if, if that makes sense so just think of what your goals are what do you want to achieve from this what are you going to get from this okay right now what is the plan to do this how many how many listings do I need to do in a week right okay I've done these listings this week what's your reward for it you, you need to give yourself a little reward not to go and buy something I mean like right I can spend all day on Sunday binge watching the real housewives of I don't know New York <laughs> Just, that's something I would do <laughs> right no one disturb me I'm watching real housewives <laughs> so anyway guys Oh, we're all wobbling now. I've picked you up. I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah, think of what your goals are for your little business and or big business, you never know. And and then think, how am I going to do it? And is this something I really want to achieve? Anyways, I hope you have a great day, great sales, and get them dreams. Bye.